Okay, so you need to add custom error bars. In order to do that, you have to start by clicking on your graph. When you do that, you'll open up the chart tools and you want the layout tab. From the layout tab, select error bars. Now once you select error bars, if you needed a custom standard error, it would be obvious to go and select error bars with standard error. If you do that, it automatically enters them. But what you'll notice is that all of your error bars are the same height even though our error values are different. So in order to get custom error bars, what we need to do is select error bars and go down to more error bar options. Select that. From the pop-up there, go down to custom. So click on custom and specify value. This is where you're going to enter your standard error values from over here. So we highlight that and select those values. Highlight this got to do it again, so it tends to always mess that part up. So let's delete that, make sure there's nothing in there. Select those values. So now those look the same. Hit OK. Close this. And now you'll notice that we have error bars that correspond to the actual values right there.